you're trying to get your crush's attention, girl, get you some. Life of Danielle James channel. How are you lovely, lovely, beautiful, beautiful people doing today? In this video, I'm gonna be giving you my tips and tricks on how to smell delicious or zay. Because who doesn't like to smell like a snack? You know? Please check out my socials. It is at the Life of Danielle James on Instagram and Diva DJ14 on TikTok. All of the products in this video will be listed in the description box. Now let's get into this video. First thing that we need to take care of is that breath, honey, because we we don't have time for that. You're not ugly. Your breath stinks. Really bad. I currently have the 3D White Crest. This is the 80%. Um, they have the red one as well, but at this current moment, I just have the 80% one. And also some Listerine because bad breath, it doesn't matter how attractive you are. It doesn't matter how much money you have. When you come around, you got wax, funky breath. It's not cute, baby. It's not cute. Next thing we're gonna talk about is bath essentials, bath shower essentials. So first things first, um, you can get you a washcloth, you can get you um, a sponge, loofah. I personally like the bath gloves as well as a nice little loofah. Please make sure that you are exchanging these loofahs out regularly because they do hold bacteria if you do not dispose of them. These are a little bit better um, for that and I like to use these in the shower. These are really great for exfoliating and stuff like that. You can of course just use a regular washcloth if you would prefer a sponge or whatever, but these are the products that I like to use. So now I'm talking to the ladies, okay? Let's be very clear. There are certain products in the bath that does nothing needs to be in certain um flowers don't need additional things to make them better flowers so let's not put things in flowers that are going to disrupt the ph of the flower yes there we go the soap that i prefer is dove i like the dove white beauty bar i like the regular or i'm just a regular regular schmegular girl from the pile. this for like a body soap um i also like ivory again i like the plain white blank ivory nothing fancy nothing too crazy um this smells really pleasant to me um but the ivory soap is has more of like a um, ivory blank soap kind of smells a little medicinal um, but I don't mind that smell or this one because it's just clean just getting you clean that's all it's meant to do and that's what I really like until you're washing your underarms because I don't I feel like people forget like you need to get up in there wash 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 okay all right next we've got our body washes i like uh this uh, aromatherapy stress relief from bath and body works i like the stress relief scent i honestly am in love with their moisturizing body wash line because it's honestly when you squirt it onto like your loofah or whatever it looks like lotion but then when you put water on it, it gets all sudsy and stuff and it lathers super nicely and i love this stuff okay like this is phenomenal and i'm like halfway through it and i'm like oh i got i might need to get some more but 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 if you cannot get this one that's okay right you can get you some basic suave um honestly the body wash is just so that you have like a sweet smell after you've like cleaned properly um they have a bunch of different scents and they says uh the fragrances as beautiful as bath and body works on here i mean I think it smells pretty good and clearly I have bath and body work as well so you know get to do something like this also in the shower with my exfoliating glove I like to use the Dove exfoliating body polish now there's a bunch of different exfoliants that you can use this one is a sugar scrub and I'm not really a big big fan of sugar scrubs I just feel like it gets too too clunky um but obviously i did have this i do really prefer the dove one um because it also has like a creaminess to it and this has uh crushed lavender and coconut milk in it and it this just smells really really nice especially for bedtime and i think it pairs nicely with a lot of stuff because it's mild and if you guys would like a proper like shower routine let me know because i'd be so so down to film now you've got to moisturize because being ashy especially in the winter time is not good all right so this is what i do and i use a couple of different products so i first start with the jergens oil infused enriching shea butter then if it's at nighttime, 
I will do the Sunset Glow by Bath and Body Works and this also has shea butter in it and vitamin E. And this body lotion smells so good. Like this scent is just, hold on. Oh my gosh, it just smells so good. It just smells soft and feminine and girly and it just, it just, Oh, it's just so good. Like there's a little bit of coconut oil cause that really locks it in. And this is why I think that it smells so good and it stays on my skin because I lock in the scent. I feel like with the coconut oil because this doesn't have any scent. Like it's, it doesn't, it doesn't, it doesn't smell like anything. Now it's into a step that I feel like a lot of people forget. And I think a lot of people think, oh, now I'm gonna get dressed and then put on my sprays, my, my uh, perfume or whatever. No, baby, let me tell you something. Because you can do whatever perfume you want, whatever body wash you want, lotion, whatever. But if your clothes don't smell good, you smell like you smell like mildew or old clothes or like old food or something like that no matter how much spray you put on something if you have mildewy clothes like it's 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 just not gonna hit i'm so sorry like you gotta make sure your clothes are washed and dried properly if i'm not trying to do too much i'm just trying to like wash my clothes like and get out or do my towels or something like you know something like that then i will just use regular old uh iPods um, and don't 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 do craziness kids right um, regular old you know laundry pods stuff like that and then what I will do is add um, just a clean uh, dryer sheet and this together will work perfectly fine as long as you dry them properly it'll be great but if I'm like doing like my laundry for like my clothes that I'm gonna be wearing throughout the week and I have the time Oh, okay, so you can use the Tide ones or I like the Gain and I like the scent Moonlight Breeze. Um, and it looks like this. And again, all of the products that I'm talking about will be listed down below, of course. Um, and I like this scent. I use two, if it's a super large load, I use three. Like, you bought them, use them. And then I will follow it up with the Moonlight Breeze Gain Dryer Sheets, okay? This together, phenomenal, but wait there's more okay then you take your unstoppables you take your unstoppables okay and this is unnecessary okay you don't need this all right oh but it smells so good you don't need this right but you add this in oh your clothes are gonna smell so good like honestly this is enough <laughs> Like, honestly, this, make sure you're clean, make sure your clothes are clean, baby. Bare Vanilla from Victoria's Secret. This smells so, 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 so good. It is literally just vanilla. Next spray that I really like is the In The Star spray from Bath & Body Works. This body spray smells like how perfumes smell. Like, if that makes sense. Scent smells how sparkly looks if that makes sense. So this is a body spray that I like. Now another body spray I have that has recently been added to my collection is the Ariana Grande Cloud body spray. This is good in case you don't have the money for the perfume, you can get the body spray. My friend actually bought me this, um, but it smells really good. It smells exactly like the perfume and it's a really sweet, um, it reminds me of like marshmallows. And apparently it's like a dupe of some really expensive perfume. Um, so that's really good if you wanna smell like you've got coins, but you don't have coins. So here's that. I also have the actual perfume of a uh, cloud and this is really, really good. It smells so good, it smells Oh, it smells so good. And also the packaging is just beautiful. So this is a perfume that I really like. So the next scent that I'm gonna be talking about is Marc Jacobs Perfect. Um, so this scent, I'm out of the Marc Jacobs uh, Oh So Sweet because that one I really, really, really like. Um, but uh, Marc Jacobs Perfect is a really good scent, but do not go crazy with this type of scent, okay? Because the Marc Jacobs Perfect when you first spray it, it's a little like, 
that's a lot. But then when it dries down, it just transforms. Like you spray this and you think you know what scent this is and then it dries down and you're like, whoa, that has a different layer to it. That's really nice. Now this is a scent that I would wear for very, very specific reasons like a date but not just like a date to the movies like a day we're going to a really 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 nice restaurant I've got my face beat my hair beat a brand new dress like an anniversary type of moment to the theater darling like something like that you walk in the room you smell you smell expensive you smell like like that chick, you know what I'm saying? I have the In The Stars perfume. Great, like you're going on a date to the movies or you're going to um, a girl's night. Like you're having fun with your girls, da da da. This is a great scent for that. Okay, so the last perfume I'm gonna be talking about is Teas by Victoria's Secret. And this scent to me, oh, it's just so good. It smells like a woman, you know? Like it just smells sweet but sultry and like it literally says it's teas and i think that's a perfect name because it does smell like that like it's sweet and powdery but not too powdery because what's that note over here what's the mystery over here you know what i mean so this is great for like valentine's day like maybe an anniversary you know you're trying to get your crushes attention girl get you some teas Get you some teas and you'll be teasing, all right. That is the end of this video. Please check out the description box because I've put everything, I have put everything that I have talked about in the video, including a couple of other little goodies that I may or may not have listed for the real ones. You know what I'm saying? Like if you're a real wing, if you're a real wing, you know. But anyway, <laughs> thanks so much for watching and I'll see all you lovely, lovely, beautiful, beautiful people again next time with another video. Bye guys. Baby.